This is what people looked like in Western Europe and Britain 10,000 years ago, not what we would have expected. One, two, three, come I'm Chris Stringer, I'm a research leader in human origins at the Natural History Museum in London and I'm holding here this wonderful reconstructed head of Cheddar Man and I've been studying the skeleton of Cheddar Man for some 40 years or so and now with DNA technology we've got the whole genome of Cheddar Man and here we've got a scientific reconstruction of what he looked like. Uh, we've got his hair form, his skin, his blue eyes, and that dark skin colour, that combination really striking. And getting out of here, information about his biology, the fact that, for example, he couldn't digest milk uh, because that came in with the advent of farming after the time of Cheddar Man. So we're getting his whole biology, how he relates to people in Europe at the time, and how he relates to people in Britain now.